Yo guys, what's up? Bobby here. So today I am going to talk about custom packs. It is, it's like a tool for Windows 7. It actually tweaks your theme so that we don't have to manually copy and paste the files over, like if you use the custom theme patcher thingy. But you can have packs and everything. You can get more packs. You only have two installed, but go on custopack.com slash gallery. And it shows all the themes you can get for it. And there's a lot of themes like like being added to it every day. So like let's say I wanted Angry Birds. You can download it. Yeah, but it's a free software, so you can download it for free. Just a pack some, click download, you can download it. There's the same thing as actually manually copy and paste in your explorer over and all that when you do your custom themes like how my start menu buttons change. It's not the original Windows 7 start button because of this um program. The theme I use for it it's where is it? I think it's on the second page. Yeah, it's called Clear Screen Sharp. And as a cruiser, that's why my uh, mouse cruiser is bigger. As a custom cruiser, rocket dock. If you want to use a rocket dock, I don't like docks really, so I don't use docks. It has standard icons, visual styles, backgrounds, cruiser, login screen, and the login screen for it's really nice actually. Um, Rocket Dock, as I said before. But when you download the theme you want, you run it. You're about to install. Do you want it to continue? Yes. It installs it. And it will appear in custom packs. You can see the screenshots of it. That's cool that the little start button change, but you can install it. I don't want the rocket dock, uh, but you don't want rocket cha um, rocket dock. You can uncheck it. You can uncheck things you don't want with it. So click next. Click you agree. You install it. It will change everything for you. Like you just did for me right now. Then after it's done doing all this, you have to reboot your system. And yeah, it detects if, if you have 64-bit, 32-bit. So all of the themes on the site work for both 32-bit, 64-bit. Whichever you have, they all work. just an easier way to get custom themes installed instead of copy and paste and everything getting permission to to like what is it to own the explore exe file just a pain in the ass but once you restart your computer your little start button icon will change which I'll show you when I restart my computer so I just rebooted my computer and you can see that it changed the little start menu icon thingy it changed the sounds and it changed the boot screen, login screen, all that good stuff to ink to an Angry Birds theme, which is pretty ugly. But if you like Angry Birds, I guess it's good. But yeah, check it out. It's on custopacks.com. As I'll show you when my browser comes up, custopacks.com. And that's not the right site. Oh, it's just custom pack. My bad. But, yeah. Check it out. If you like this video, subscribe, comment, post a, vi a video response. Peace.